do you suffer from rheumatoid arthritis and you are considering adding natural remedies? Are you tempted to try natural remedies instead of reaching for another painkiller like Tylenol or Ibuprofen? My patients often ask me about salt baths, honey, probiotics, garlic or ginger. Are you interested in learning more about this and many others? Then watch this video until the end to learn about 10 natural remedies that may help you with your pain, with the swelling and fatigue. Let's begin. Rheumatologistoncall.com Salt baths. When you are in pain, that will send a message to your muscles around the joints and that will cause muscle contraction and a lot of tightness. Let's say you have some neck and shoulder pain. Then, indulging in a soothing salt bath can provide relief from pain while it's going to promote muscle relaxation. It may be a great idea after a long day when you have been working a lot and your muscles are tight to go to do a salt bath. Paraffin wax bath. Have you ever been to a nail salon or a spa? Most of the time they offer you there a paraffin wax bath for your hands or the feet. The paraffin wax will smooth your skin and coat your small joints. The warmth of the wax will increase blood circulation and relax those small muscles. The paraffin wax will diminish your stiffness and pain. Probiotics or yogurt. There is a strong evidence that a big part of the inflammation that we see in rheumatoid arthritis is related to the gut microbiota. There are some studies that show people using daily supplements with probiotics will have less pain and stiffness. Why don't you consume yogurt regularly instead of using a supplement or a pill? It will bring you the bacteria that you need, which is much healthier and more convenient. You can even make yogurt in your own kitchen. Manuka honey. Honey has been known for centuries for its antibacterial and anti-inflammatory properties. Manuka honey is a special type of honey produced in New Zealand by bees that pollinate the manuka tree. Eating regularly in small quantities might have a great effect on your body. Now, if you have diabetes, be aware it may increase your blood sugar. Do you enjoy this video? Then if you do, please help me with my educational efforts and press that subscribe button. If you do this, then the algorithm of YouTube will show this video to more people. You may also give a like or leave a comment. Thank you for considering to help. Melatonin. Melatonin is a hormone responsible for regulating sleep patterns. Now, many patients with rheumatoid arthritis suffer from sleep disturbances and sleep deprivation because of pain. Sleep disturbances impact the way that people feel with rheumatoid arthritis. And it was shown that patients with rheumatoid arthritis and high disease activity, they have lower levels of melatonin. There are also some contradictory studies that report that melatonin might actually affect the joint cartilages, exhibiting some anti-inflammatory properties. Now, using melatonin might restore the rhythm of your sleep and will help with rheumatoid arthritis. Garlic. Garlic is one of the most common used spices in the world and it's known for its effects to decrease blood pressure, to decrease the cardiovascular risk, to have antibacterial and anti-inflammatory effects. In 2020, a randomized controlled trial on 70 patients with rheumatoid arthritis showed that those that took 1,000 milligrams of garlic for eight weeks had a decrease in their markers of inflammation, 
decrease fatigue and decrease pain and swelling in their joints. Ginger Ginger is a plant from the same family as turmeric. It is very well known in the Asian cuisine, but it is also known to help with nausea in pregnant females. Ginger was also known to have antioxidants and anti-inflammatory properties. In patients with rheumatoid arthritis, 1500 mg of ginger supplementation for a period of 12 weeks was also shown to reduce the markers of inflammation, joint pain, and swelling. Turmeric Turmeric, also called the golden spice, comes from the roots of the curcuma longa plant. Turmeric has been used for many centuries in the Asian cuisine and it is known for antimicrobial and anti-inflammatory properties. Its major active ingredient is curcumin. There are more than 120 clinical trials that show the effect of curcumin in many diseases. In rheumatoid arthritis patients, turmeric was given daily for at least 90 days and it was shown to reduce the pain and swelling in the joints, along with reducing the need to take other anti-inflammatory medications like ibuprofen or naproxen. Make sure turmeric is combined with black pepper for a better gut absorption. Sauna. Studies have shown that sauna improves blood circulation, relaxes the muscles, reduces inflammation and relieves pain. Now, infrared saunas use a specific type of light to emit infrared waves that will penetrate deeply into the skin. The heat will relax your muscles and increase the blood circulation. This naturally helps your body ease the swelling, the stiffness and fatigue, which is common in patients with rheumatoid arthritis. More than that, the heat from an infrared sauna releases endorphins. These are the feel-good chemicals that interact with the brain receptors. The rise in endorphins will reduce pain or how you perceive pain and will enhance your mood, making you feel more relaxed. CBD oil or CBD cream. CBD is a non-psychoactive medicinal compound which is derived from cannabis plant. Please note that CBD oil does not contain THC, which is responsible for the marijuana psychological effect. So CBD does not cause the high effect. CBD oil was shown to impact the level of inflammation at the level of your brain, but can also reduce inflammation markers at the local level in the joints. There are some suggestions that CBD oil may actually help your sleep, which is a problem that is very common in patients with rheumatoid arthritis. The National Arthritis Foundation ran a survey showing that 61% of people use a liquid CBD form, while 55% use a topical product. In 2022, there was another study about CBD that showed that 80% of people that use that reported pain improvement or reported physical improvement and others reported improvement in the sleep quality. However, even CBD may help with arthritis related symptoms such as pain, insomnia and anxiety. You have to know there have been no rigorous clinical studies in people with arthritis to confirm that. CBD should never be used to replace the disease-modifying drugs that prevent permanent damage in your joints and inflammation in your joints. You should also discuss with your doctor that might be able to tell you if there are any potential drug-drug interactions. Now, in conclusion, when it comes to managing symptoms of rheumatoid arthritis, natural remedies can be helpful to add. However, it's important to note that these remedies may not be universally safe and can potentially have adverse effects when they are combined with prescribed medications. That is why here at Rheumatologist on Call, we take pride in our 
specialized and integrative approach, which is tailored specifically to people living with rheumatoid arthritis. Our focus goes beyond just treatment. We prioritize education on crucial aspects as nutrition. We offer online courses and personalized physical therapy sessions, which are designed to meet your needs. We treat the whole body and the mind. We treat the patients and not only their disease. If you or someone that you know wants to improve sooner with rheumatoid arthritis, you can visit our website or contact my office to schedule a consultation. Thank you very much for joining me and don't forget to subscribe, like and share this video with people that are in need. Once again, thank you and I will see you soon. rheumatologistoncall.com